Wyoming might be best known for its national parks, Yellowstone and the Grand Tetons. But there's so much more to the Wyoming outdoors. Today, we'll explore the less visited but just as spectacular Bighorn Mountains region. We'll hike and enjoy the incredible views at Bighorn Canyon. Then we'll head high up into the Bighorns and hike to a long abandoned fire lookout tower. And we'll escape the heat in the ice cold river in Tongue River Canyon, plus a lot more. Let's get things started on the fantastic Ranger's Delight Trail at Bighorn Canyon National Recreation Area. We had this less than two mile trail all to ourselves as we hiked right up to the canyon rim. You can drive right up to the Devil Canyon Overlook where you'll get some of the best views in the park. Bighorn Canyon has a lot of interesting historic 19th century ranch buildings. They came searching for gold, but stayed for the ranching. The highlight of my day was seeing these wild mustangs up on the ridge. After a day exploring the canyon, we drove up and into the heart of the Bighorn Mountains, where we stayed at Ty Flume Campground in Bighorn National Forest. At the campground, we enjoyed some hammock time cook dinner on the campfire, and experience one of the most incredible rainbows I've ever seen. All right, it rained for the second time tonight. It was a short thunderstorm, and then there was a great rainbow. And now we're back trying to revive this fire. We say goodbye to Ty Flume Campground in search of a historic abandoned place. Built in the 1930s and long since deserted, the Black Mountain Fire Lookout Tower is high in Wyoming's Bighorn Mountains. We walked around the wooden deck, but be careful. Some of the planks are missing and others feel like they are about to break. With 360 degree views for miles around, we imagined the long, lonely hours spent looking for wildfires by those in decades past. After a great hike to the abandoned lookout, we head over to our favorite campground of the trip. All right, we just moved campgrounds. We're at Prune Creek. Site number eight, and we set up our hammocks and took a little nap. Helen's still enjoying her book, and we've got this really nice creek. Let's check it out. I saw some trout in there when I looked at it earlier. Some nights we just do the quick and easy dinner. So tonight I heated up rice and beans in the sandwich maker for me, and Justin's having a bean and cheese quesadilla. The sandwich maker is pretty much our go-to dinner fuel. Enjoy.
We say goodbye to the beautiful Prune Creek Campground and head to our favorite hike of the trip. The Tongue River Canyon with its sheer limestone walls and river just inviting us to jump right in. been a hot, hot hike. Let's go swimming down there. Well, we came down, I came down through there. I was a little worried that I have friends down here already. And by friends, I mean wildlife. I don't see any. And then got this little swimming hole. 